Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a story called My Robot Robbie. But before I start, please subscribe to my channel for more such videos every week. My Robot Robbie, written by Dilip Madhukar Salvi, who was an Indian editor and author. His most famous works are A Passage to Antarctica and Fire on the Moon. Have you ever seen a robot? If you haven't, do you want to meet one? Please do let me know in the comments below. This beautiful story is about a robot named Robbie. So let's start. The author starts the story by describing his robot which is made of shining metals including its head, chest, arms. The robot's blue eyes are made of electric bulbs and it moves on four wheels like a toy car. The unique thing about the robot is that it does not have a metallic voice, instead have a soft and soothing voice. The author loves this robot a lot. The, the author demands Robbie the robot for milk. It obeys its command and again he demands for some biscuit. Robbie brings it again. Here the author compares his robot with his previous servant Shamu who would get angry for demanding so much. Robbie is an obedient robot. Not only the author, even his mummy loves the robot. Robbie for his hard work, especially its help in the kitchen. One day, when the author was playing cricket, by mistake, it hit him in the chest and it falls down. He called his father. His father pressed some buttons, but nothing happened. It was lying still. The author insisted on calling a doctor. But his father said, not a doctor, but a robot mechanic. Let's see what is going to happen now. Will the robot get all right? His father called the robotics service center. After some time, the mechanic came and checked Robbie. He unscrewed the plate covering his stomach. The author was shocked to see the red, yellow and black wires, circuits on boards and multicolored tiny cylinders and numbered black boxes. It looked like the inside of a TV. The robot mechanic explained that it is the electronic brain of the robot. The author was shocked to know that they have their brain in the stomach. The mechanic said that they can have their brain anywhere, even its leg, provided space is enough for them. After operating Robbie, he put the plate over Robbie's stomach and pressed a button. Robbie got up like nothing had happened. The author informed that the cricket match is over and what did Robbie do? It went to the kitchen to help mummy again. So that is all about the story. Hope you all enjoyed it. See you all next week with another video. Thank you.